Hey everybody, it's Sandra here with the Clean and Simple Life. I hope everybody's doing well today. Just wanted to come on real quick and give you a little tip of something that I'm doing. So uh, you guys know that I made some bread on Sunday, I think it was, and I had just a little bit left, and of course it's gone pretty stale by now. Um, so what I thought I'd do is make some croutons out of it. Uh, we're gonna have some Caesar salad tonight with dinner. We're gonna have some, uh, some pierogies. Love me some pierogies. Um, so I wanted to make a Caesar salad and I don't wanna waste any of that great bread that I made. So what I did was I just cubed it up, put it in my bowl here and I'm gonna add some grapeseed oil. You could use olive oil if you want or canola oil, whatever oil you've got. I like the grapeseed oil just because it um, it's got a high smoking point and I'm going to be putting this in the oven at a fairly high temperature. So just gave it a little quick toss there and I'm going to add our herb and garlic dip mix. And I just have a little bit left in my jar. So I'm not, you know me, I don't measure a lot. Um, so I just tossed the rest of that in there. And then, yes, this is an old jar, but it's our Caesar dressing mix. So I'm gonna be using that to make my Caesar dressing, of course. But I also want to use it uh, to put a little bit on my croutons just to give that Caesar salad flavor. And I didn't grab a spoon, so I'm just going to toss this around a little bit. It should be just fine. So yeah, so I'm tossing it around, making sure that all the cubes of bread are getting all that goodness on them. So there we go. You guys see that a little bit. Hope everybody's doing well and uh, staying healthy and eating healthy. Uh, um, and just a reminder that we have our surprise packs that are still on. They are going really fast. So if you want to get in on that, make sure you put your order in ASAP. We've already sold out of the first batch. Uh, they're making a second batch for us now. And we've also got our uh, three-week dinner, three-week dinner collection on for 20% off. That's gonna be on until the 23rd, so until uh, Sunday, no, Monday of uh, this coming Monday. So make sure you get in on that. That's 20% off and with that, I'm also sending you a meal plan that goes with that, gives you your entire grocery list of what you need to get um, and recipes to go with that. And I've got another uh, stock your pantry item that I'm gonna be posting here uh, later today or tomorrow um, talking about how to stock your pantry that also goes along with the uh, with the three-week meal plan um, so make sure to watch for that and our taste test of the month the mango lassi that's on until March 31st so don't forget to get in on that it is super delicious the mango chicken turned out amazing with that so Lots of great things that you can do with that. I'm actually, um, Tuesday, in Test Kitchen Tuesday, I'm gonna be using that as our monthly taste test. So I'm gonna test it out and I'm gonna be trying some lime cupcakes with a, what am I calling this? A mango lassi buttercream frosting. Mm, does that sound yummy? Yeah, I think so. Um, hopefully something tropical as I'm not looking like I'm gonna be going on my tropical cruise that I was supposed to be going on. So maybe that'll make me think of, uh, of nicer weather and nicer times. So anyway, these are my croutons. They're all on my pan. They're ready to go. I'm using my Pampered Chef Stone and I'm gonna pop those in the oven at 425 and they won't take very long. All I need them to do is toast up and uh, and brown just slightly. So I would suggest when you put them in, don't leave them. Just make sure you keep an eye on them. Five, maybe 10 minutes at most they should take. Okay, so don't leave them unattended. Um, but yeah, so that'll be my uh, my croutons. Of course, I've got more than I need for, for tonight's Caesar salad. So what I'll do is I'll put them in a... Uh, in an airtight container and they'll keep for a few days anyway and uh, we'll be having more salad over the next couple of days so we'll just use that up or if you like it in your soup it's also good in soup so um, I have a little bit of that potato soup left that I uh, I popped it in the freezer to keep it um, so would also be very good on top of one of those so 
Anyway, that's my quick little tip for today. I hope everybody is doing well. Thank you all for your love and your support that you show me all the time on my page. I love it. Uh, keep the conversations going. Show me what you're cooking and what's in your uh, what's in your on your dinner table for tonight. I'd love to find out. Stay healthy, everybody. I'm sending you all love, and I will talk with you guys soon. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.